The sound of gears. Watch yourself. Did it harm you? A protective barrier. With something inside, Aleph can sense a great power here. Formidable. But this not without your assistance. Aleph will subdue the crystals. You must destroy them. Your window will be short. The spell is taxing. And Aleph can only maintain it for so long. Be quick. Aleph will begin her spell. You run to each of the four crystals. The crystal. Prepare yourself. Move your forms quickly. Now, destroy the crystals. Good. Now to examine. The body? That did not sound good. It is a trap! Aleph is pleased to have you at her side. They are called Aurorans, a strange type of Daedra, I think. Aleph has only faced them once before. If she recalls correctly, they choose their allegiances carefully. Very... Let Aleph see. This is Yathnir's. His body here. But why? He was to be interred near his home in East March. Keeping us out, yes. But perhaps, perhaps also keeping him in. 
Elif has tried to have Yafnir summoned from Aetherius, and it has never worked. Perhaps with a barrier down, we speak to him directly. This one knows how to reach out. Elif can draw him to this place, so close to his body. What do you say? Are you ready? You have seen the spirit of Yafnir, but always just for a moment. Elif told you she has power. Magical gifts, connections to lands beyond. She will use them to draw this spirit. Elif will start the ritual. Who summons me? Hush, spirit. Elif will ask the question. What do you wish to know? I will tell you what I can. Elif demands the name of your murderer. Who killed you, Yafnir? It was the Argonian. My subordinate sees all colors. This one knew it would be so. Be gone, spirit. Elif is done with you. I have done as you asked. Release me to walk in Sovngarde. Go. Elif will call for you again soon. Sovngarde indeed. You heard the Guildmaster. Sees all colors. She murdered Yofni. Perhaps for you. This one has suspected all along. The lizard was the one to become Guildmaster. The lizard was the one who set us on this crusade. Aleph smells something foul. Find Merrick and the Council. They are probably still in their moot at Fort Amul. They need to know about this, and they will heed your word.
What news do you have? I didn't even want to let myself think it. When she disappeared after your visit to the Aeliad Ruin. What is your proof, my friend? The Council will need solid evidence. Aelith did what? Stendar's breath, that's disgusting. I'll have to talk to her when she returns. But I suppose it did answer our concerns. Oblivion take lizards and cats both. Seize all colors will be found and thrown in a cell. Stay in touch, comrade. We will need you when the time comes. Until then. of you, comrade. I have an urgent message for you. Aelith needs to speak to you immediately. I don't know what happened. She looks grim, so it can't have been good. You should find her as soon as... She's waiting for you at the Rift in Guildhall in the Rift. Good luck, comrade. Not as far as I know. Every member of the Guild received instructions to detain her if she's sighted. I still... I still can't believe she killed Guildmaster Iceblade. Tribunal, protect us. Then did the skin stealers take Rhonda? Well met, champion. It is? And your arrival is not unexpected. I've been waiting for you to arrive. Prince Ernskar commanded me to keep watch. He wants to speak to you. He's on the battlements at the East Gate, watching the movements of Fildgor Orkthane's troop. Things are quiet here. For now. Indeed. The soldiers call this place Jorhenstad. For King Jorhen is determined to stop the Orc thing and restore peace to Eastmarch from this very encampment. There's still some tension. The prince made accusations when the king was poisoned, and that certainly hasn't helped matters. To his credit, though, Prince Ernskar seeks to make amends for the strained relations. The assassination attempt hasn't hindered the Skald King's ability to command, if that's what you're asking. The dark elf healers tend to him, and he grows stronger every day. Hello 
there. Hello there. Well met, my friend. My father is still weak from the poison, but he's recovering. I'm organizing things here while he gets his strength back. I need to regain the confidence of our Dark Elf and Argonian allies. My regrettable actions at Fort Armel have made them wary. Speak to the highest ranking pact leaders in the camp. General Yveth Noramil of the Dark Elves and the Argonian leader Eyes of Steel. See what we can do to demonstrate the strength of the pact. Endures. War approaches like a storm on the wind, and the prince needs our help. Why should I trust him or his... So impatient. I won't waste any more of your precious time. Actions speak louder than words, anyway. Challenge Hald Bitterblade. He... staring at me. I'm very busy. I don't have time running errands for the princeling, are you? And I'm not your first. My aides tell me you went to see the lizard before coming to me. I suppose Ernskar wants to affirm his commitment to the pact. Wants to drink vile talk means nothing. A blood contract, on the other hand, is binding. Use my dagger, Viper's Strike, on any storm fists you slay. The blood it absorbs powers its enchantment. Bring it back when the dagger is fully charged. To charge its enchantment, yes. If that makes you or the princeling squeamish, however, I perfectly...
Norse king and his foreign allies can throw challenges at me as often as they want. I so enjoy killing them. Ready to reclaim the amulet of kings. Hello there. Mysterious champion returned, and I see that you brought me his head. Bitterblade was a worthy foe, and your efforts on behalf of Prince Ernskar have him. A god. I let the heralds. Ernskar's errand runner has returned. So you have. I'd applaud, but killing a few Stormfists isn't really that significant of an accomplishment. However, your efforts on behalf of the Princeling prove that he does wish to make amends for his... <laughs> <laughs> yes, true. But that's not as much fun. Oh, very well. I shall work with Prince Ernskar. He shall benefit from my considerable knowledge and expertise. Well met, my friend. I received word that General Yevet Noramil and Eyes of Steel will meet with me. I'll show them the respect they deserve and work to strengthen our alliance. Once again, your aid advances our cause. You have my gratitude. I need to discuss strategy with the Thanes and pack leaders. 
The Argonian and Dark Elf leaders are ready to meet. It's time to gather a council of war. Do you think you could convince the Thanes to attend as well? They're an independent lot, but their advice would be welcome. Start with Thane Harvold. He's a close friend of my father's. If any of the Thanes can be counted on, it's Harvold. We'll meet in front of the Healer's tent. I'm sure my father will feel well enough to join us. I'm a little busy at the moment. Come back later. Would he now? And I suppose I should just jump at his command? Why should I do that? He's demonstrated nothing but hard-headedness and brashness since before his father was poisoned. I suppose for the sake of my friendship with Yoron, I should give the prince a second chance. I'll meet with him. Then I suggest you seek out Odo Wolf's sister next. She's a fine woman, if a bit odd. Very fond of wolves. Good luck finding her, though. Not that you asked. But if you want my advice, talk to Oda's house car. Jema tries to keep track of her thing, which isn't an easy task. Last I saw, she was up at the front gates looking for her master. Hello there. And do you see her? She's not here. She's out there somewhere communing with her beloved wolves. How can I protect her when she runs off into the woods without so much as a buy or leave? She's a maddening woman. Ugh, maddening. Last I saw, she was east of the camp, communing with wolves. <laughs> but she does have a connection to the creatures. I've never seen one so much as growl at her. Uh, of course, you won't be so lucky. But if you kill any wolves, she won't be happy with you. Try eating a canis cap mushroom. It's supposed to mask your scent or something. Wolves won't attack you. Or so I hear. I just stay away from wolves. Or you can kill wolves until you find Thane Oda. But that won't end well if you want her help. Canis cap mushrooms tend to grow on logs. I think I saw some on the big log right outside this gate. I love coming out here and basking in all this nature. Have we met? What is that delightful scent? <gasps> Another admirer of wolf kind. You've eaten a canis cap. You have that wonderful musky scent of fur and dirt and grass and old meat. Mmm. You don't seem to be truly enjoying being one of the wolves. No accounting for taste, I suppose. In any case, you said the prince sent you. No doubt he wants me at this I am pleased that he thought to send someone who respects my wolf kin. I'll attend the council. The lingering effect of the mushroom will keep you safe, but it wears off quickly. You should find Thane Yegi. If he's sober, he should.
shooting. Mead or milk? Are you a Nord or a Nat? <laughs> my reputation precedes me. I may be half drunk most of the time, but my mind's still sharp. Prince Ernskar wants to meet with some of the Thanes and the Pact Delegates, am I right? Of course I am, but spare me your assurances. The Prince is a skeever. You know what will convince me to attend a boring war council? Mead. Specifically, some of Volyar's Meadery's best vintages. Some crates recently arrived in camp. I know who doesn't have it. Me! A crate was given to the Dark Elves, but they loathe the stuff. Ask their quartermaster. Bet they'll give it away, or, or just look for bottles lying around. I don't care where it comes from, as long as it's mead. Greetings. Not one of my soldiers. Do you need something? Mead? Disgustingly sweet stuff. Makes me long for Shane or a flask of Flynn. Those are proper beverages. I don't understand this powerful craving for mead. Where do the Nords put it? It doesn't seem to hinder their ability to swing their weapons, though. Hello. Any luck acquiring some of that Volya mead? Ah, this is the stuff. Drink with me to the Skull King's health. I, I mean, the Skull King. A Skull King would not be a good thing. That's the Nord spirit, sort of. Next time, though, try it like this. I suppose one drink isn't enough. <laughs> I need some fortification if I'm going to attend the council. I'll head over after I drink this bottle. and the body of Queen Lernhild. For what purpose? The Orc Thane plans to use them at the Dragon Shrine to usurp my father's throne. A necromantic ritual, perhaps? Crown is a powerful artifact. I shudder to think what the Orc Thane can accomplish with it. I don't like the idea of that bastard using our fabled crown. And I hate that he has our beloved Queen's body. Father, you honor us. I'm glad to see you up and around. My brother seeks to pull my sister's soul from Sovereign Guard. The crown of Freydis will see the soul, not the man. It's good to see you well, Joram. We've been discussing how to approach Skaldafen. Yes, yes. We discuss and we strategize while Fildgore digs in and strengthens his defenses. So? Have we come to any conclusions? The storm fists have fortified the primary path to the Dragon Shrine. A frontal assault would take time that we may not have. Time is a luxury we don't possess. If Filgo completes this ritual, all is lost. That's why you wanted to see those scouting reports. You think there's another way into Skaldafen? There is always another way. Champion, may we speak?
Well met, my courageous friend. The time of our victory is at hand. Yes, thank you for all you've done, but your skills are needed again. Our troops will begin the assault on Skaldafin, but we need a faster approach to reach Filgor. Yes, we have several of our best scouts searching the area. Thane Mira found something in the hills north of here. Those dragon shrines are rife with passages and secret entrances. Good. Make sure the way is clear for our assault. Speak to General Nora Mio. He's been coordinating our effort to scout the area for another way in. The Ebonheart Pact stands together to defeat the Orc Thane. Send for me, if you need me, sire. Over here, champion. The time has come to crush Fildgor and the Stormfist Brigade once and for all. Ah, yes, the scouting reports. It wants you to sneak into Skaldafin while we distract the bulk of the Orkthane's army. Skaldafin is special to the Nords. Joran always planned to hold the moot there, but then Fildgor moved in. We think Fildgor wants to use the Dragon Shrine to steal Queen Nernhild's soul and force the crown of Freydis to recognize him as the true ruler of Skyrim. Meet Scout Snowhunter to the north and east. He'll show you how to reach Skaldafin. <laughs> 